Cryo-electron microscopy has revolutionized life sciences and medicine and biology because suddenly this method can give us eyes and we can understand how life works, how disease works and how we can influence that to try to heal. Being able to see atoms a little bit, to guess where the atoms were, now it's so precise that each atom is seen with the bounds between them. It's just incredible how science is progressing further. We have combined the expertise in engineering and biology from the EPFL, the Universities of Lausanne and Geneva. The center provides the high-resolution structural analysis and is also a platform for knowledge exchange and advancing the technology and teaching. Cryonym has become the most important technique to visualize very small biological macromolecules. It allows to determine their three-dimensional arrangement at resolutions that are sufficient to separate individual atoms. We install top-end microscope which is existing in the world, which is called Titan Cryosis, and we can cover broad range of the molecular size. We also able on the fly process those data and give at the end, like after two, three days to the user, already structure and model so that user can afterwards build his own experiments further and move as fast as possible. We would really like to make accessible cryo-EM to the larger life science community, both in academia and in industry. We share our know-how and we optimize the resources. By this way, the researchers have access to the best experts and the most uh, suitable technique to solve their scientific questions. Ultimately, we would love to support a pipeline wherein chemists can design specifically small molecules that drug the molecular targets that have been identified by geneticists, and in this process, open new therapeutic strategies to treat various diseases. We use cryo-EM to study human cell surface receptors, which are extremely important therapeutic targets. By gaining structural and molecular insight into ligand receptor complexes, we obtain fundamental insights into how cells communicate with their environment. Now, having this center, which we cannot say it's the best in the world because well, you can never say that, but you can say, as that's a nice expression, second to none. So we have the DCA, which is second to none in cryo-electron microscopy, and which has established itself in an extraordinarily short time. Now it works, it goes, it produces science. This was an achievement.